When Littler opened its doors in 1942 as a small labor law practice in San Francisco, the firm aimed to hire the best labor attorneys with diverse backgrounds. This included the hiring of Littler's first female attorney, Irene Craviato, in 1944, a time when women were not very common in the legal industry. Irene not only opened the door for other women attorneys, but she welcomed them in. Fast forward to today. Littler's unwavering dedication to supporting women is demonstrated in the strength of our numbers. 60% of our employees, 56% of our management committee, and 37% of our board of directors identify as women. Additionally, 42% of leadership roles at the firm are held by women. This has been achieved through the intentional work of a countless number of individuals from Littler's leadership ranks throughout the years, both women and men. While we are proud of our statistics, we also understand that inclusion, equity, and diversity are not about the numbers. Rather, it's about the individuals those numbers represent. In honor of this year's Women's History Month theme, Women Who Advocate for Equity, Diversity, and Inclusion, we celebrate the women who came before us the trailblazers who paved the way for others and helped create a space where every person can succeed and build a meaningful career. We also recognize the many allies who are and have been critically important in advocating for and advancing the interests of women, not just in our firm, but society as a whole. Throughout my career, I've been inspired by the late representative Barbara Jordan. In addition to being a great speaker, her commitment to justice and morality was unmatched. And after all, that is what inclusion, equity, and diversity is all about. How many people can say they work in a firm with women who are making history today? It's no small thing to have a network of fearless women who you know you can call on for support, who encourage you to shine your light brightly, and also to lift as you rise my commitment to IE&D stems from a deep connection to the Ohana Affinity Group within Littler. It is this unwavering support and belonging from my Littler colleagues that allows me to be my true self. And I'm honored to be the first Asian woman to serve on Littler's board of directors. Personally, there are several women who guided me in my own journey to becoming Littler's managing director. My first mentor as a lawyer was Grace Day, who is a legal legend in Missouri and was a trailblazer for women. Grace took me under her wing and provided me with real trial by fire experience that helped shape my career and my life as a lawyer. When I arrived at Littler in 2001, I was pleasantly surprised to find that so many leaders at the firm were women, including at the time, Wendy Tice Walner, the firm's managing director. I knew from the beginning of my career at the firm that this place was different that Littler truly valued the contributions of women and that this was a place where I would be supported to accomplish my own career goals. In celebration of International Women's Day and Women's History Month, please join me in honoring the women who have and continue to advocate for inclusion, equity, and diversity. Only through our collective efforts in encouraging and empowering one another are we able to build equitable workplaces where women can achieve their personal and professional goals. Because when women support each other, incredible things happen.